And the eclipse, of course, drew a lot of people to the Rangeley area. That's where Fox 23's Mal Meyer was, catching up with those who traveled from near and far to experience the event. We asked dozens of people where they came from. There were Americans from as far away as California, Utah, and Texas, all here for one incredible experience. I saw a partial last time. For some, it was a last minute decision. I just figured why not? It's a once in a lifetime opportunity and it's, the weather looked perfect for it. When cloudy skies threatened to derail Scott Reeves plan near Rochester, New York, he rerouted to Maine. We spotted this on the map and they thought that's be a good place to observe from. Most people we talked to had never seen any eclipse or just a partial one in the past. Really looking forward to you know enjoying the great day and having a great clear view and yeah. just pretty excited. Soon, those not sure exactly what to expect would understand why people who have already experienced totality keep coming back for more. It's always amazing. It's just, it's phenomenal. You think, oh my God, this is, you know, the, the universe. It just, I think it, it's awe-inspiring. It was amazing. It was incredible. It was beautiful. It was really nice. I'm glad I was here. What did you think? It was the most beautiful thing I've seen in my life. Just, it was amazing to be able to see it with my family and the people I love most. Now that it's over, it's time to start planning again. The next one is in 2026 in Spain, so I may do that one too. <laughs> I don't think I'm going to make the 2044 one in North America, though. <laughs> I will be wherever it is in 2044. Yeah. It's truly amazing. I've never seen anything like it before. I wish it happened every day. <laughs> in Rangeley, Melmire, Fox 23 News at 10.